Our first televised race is the Connolly's Red Mills Ladies Auction Maiden Hurdle. That's a bit of a mouthful. Uh, but with me are Anya O'Connor, Lisa O'Neill, who, uh, Lisa, this is part of a, a big series that you've started for Ladies National Hunt Riders. Yeah, absolutely. It's a Ladies National Hunt series and it's a great initiative to um, heighten the focus on female riders and strengthen the public perception of female riders. Um, it's very much an opportunity for young girls to pick up rides and open doors and make new contacts. Um, so so it's, it's all based on a point system, so it's double points for any girl that hasn't ridden more than 10 winners. So uh, hopefully the overall winner, we got great support from Red Mills along the way and they've put up a prize of €1,000 in their um, store in Kilkenny. Um, but yeah, it's, it's a great initiative and uh, it's great to have it on a, a day like today, um, Thayeste's Day. It's, it's a massive day uh, for, and a great exposure for girls. And uh, it's great that it's supported on a big day, but also all the big trainers rolling in behind it. Yeah, absolutely. Um, do you know it? It, it passed the uh, passed the trainers um, board in HRI, and Shane Doyle has been a big influence behind the whole um, setup of the Ladies National Hunt series. So we're fantastic with the field of runners um, that there is today, and there's prize money down as far as sixth place. You yourself have had a prestigious career riding big winners like Munster Nationals and Kerry Nationals and Cheltenham Festival winners, but great for opportunity for maybe lesser known names. Definitely, um, like a big day like today is great exposure, especially on RTE. Um, so it's fantastic uh, just to be a small part of it. You ride so cowboy for Declan Queeley? Yeah, fingers crossed. Um, he he was third over two and a half mile in Limerick at Christmas. So um, we'll see what happens. And Anya, you started off the campaign with a big boost. You won the first leg of the series. Yeah, I was quite lucky. Uh, I rode a, a filly for Eddie Harty. She won quite well, spruced up. So, uh, yeah, it was great. It was great. It's a filly I would have never gotten the chance to ride before. So I, I was quite lucky to get the ride in her that day. And, you know, it's, it was an opportunity for me. So, yeah, it was great. Jessica Harrington is another big uh, name trainer supporting the race here today and you write where the wind blows for her. Yeah, where the wind blows. He was seventh in uh, Maiden Hurdle and Nace. Uh, he's a bit to find and form with A1 and his bumper form, but yeah, it's a good ride to get and, and great to ride for Miss Harrington. Would you have ridden for her much before? Uh, I haven't. I think I've had one or two rides for her, so uh, yeah, it's nice, nice to ride, get a ride over hurdles for her today. And things are going very well for yourself at the moment. You're crossing the Irish water quite a bit. Yeah, over and back to the UK a bit. Um, I'm quite lucky I rode Manella Rocco and Warwick yesterday it was a lovely ride to get for John Joe Neal and he won um, and I go over and back a bit for Harry Fry best of luck to the two of you for the day thanks very much Andy